I am at Aldi. At the dumpster at Aldi. Silly. Looks like there's something there. Let's see if we can dig through that. There's something good. You don't even need to dig. That's what I like to see. Bananas on top. Our favorites. flat we've seen it recently this works in this the weather just right in the back Happens when I don't come every day. <laughs> it just keeps filling up. Getting tons of strawberry right here and bananas right next to it. A lot of bananas. We definitely can't dig there.
Ruby Bananas. Uh-oh. Hear that crack? The board I was standing on broke. I was going through it. Down the hallway this clay. Look at me. between a treasure hunt and the game operation. Remove funny bone. Buzzer on that one. Protein shakes. Pretty sneaky, sis. <laughs> Move hamburger buns and honey. berries to play with. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Avalanche. That may have been my first dumpster avalanche. 
I didn't even know they existed. I heard of them. They were rumored to happen. I've never experienced one. and pennies. I like the box. One. Let's see what we got. Okay. Stolen. I hope so. Jay Wiz. Cheese and Mr. Beans tried to get away. No, 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 you're an indoor. See you at home. Hi, Dumpsterinos and Frugalistas. You brought home a great haul of free food. Wow, that's a fancy little snackerino. Prosciutto, provolone and breadsticks. Brother's label came off and sat on sister, so now what do we do? Uh, we gotta throw them both bone. away. That's silly. I tried to peel it off and it wouldn't come off. A four pack of chocolate, chocolate. protein shakes, a 24 ounce squeezable bottle of honey. I asked the universe for this. For honey? For uh, coughs, like if, we, if anyone gets sick. It's great for sore throats. Yes, but putting for, it in warm tea for cough pineapple oh really yes and it's been scientifically proven it's not oh, just me okay I'll have to get a pineapple the universe will bring you one if you're meant to have it mm -hmm. we obviously were meant to have two boxes of toaster waffles multi-grain sandwich skinnies big old tub of organic spring mix awesome a bag of asparagus and a bag of Fuji apples. We were getting low on apples there for yes, a while. We were. I'm very happy to see those apples. I am too. Asparagus always a treat. Five pounds of golden potatoes. More salad fixins. We've got the greenhouse grown Boston lettuce. A delicate lettuce, if you ask me. Mm -hmm. so what are you looking at? There's a turkey vulture circling. They usually circle. You know what I thought you were going to say, even though you're looking up? What? There's a turd. Oh, and it, then where? Where turd. is he going to tell? There's a turd on the roof. There's Rolling a turd off the in the tree. <laughs> like, where's, head. where? Just when you said tur. A turkey vulture. And they generally circle when something is. So, do they know something? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's what I'm just thinking, which one of us is about to go. <laughs> yeah. Two Asian chopped salad kits. I love these salad no, kits. The, They're so convenient and yummy. I love that. Sauce. Never buy these. But we love them. Two packages of raspberries. Oh, have I told my raspberry story lately? I was about four or five. Oh, my parents were having a dinner party, so they were getting ready for that, and I was just kind of like farting around the house. And for some reason, there was a quart of raspberries mm -hmm. there. And I don't know why, but me being me, I tried one and liked it, so I ate the entire quart because that's just who I am. You Even as a four-year-old. <laughs> <laughs> and then later that night, I threw up, um, and I don't think it was related to the raspberries at oh, all because really? I had some stomach issues oh. just all the time. But because that was my first experience of raspberries, and I'd eaten so many of them, of course, I associated 
Oh, like cigarettes. The vomitousness or, or... with the raspberries. And it, it was years before I could eat raspberries again. But I can eat them oh, now. I thought you were going to say, what? I threw up all over the white carpet. My parents never During had a white carpet. Party. Oh, no. Okay, never mind. Yeah, they weren't all groovy with shag white carpeting. No. you have white carpeting? No. Off-white. Which had... we resolved to brown. <laughs> <laughs> Very quickly. Got more and more off white. <laughs> when boys and a uh, dog. It was off white, then beige, then yeah. Yeah. Just, just a it's nice like having chocolate th brown. <laughs> yeah, three carpets in one. <laughs> you know, that's very frugal. I one time uh, lived in a condo that had wall to wall beige carpeting, and I was painting a wall, and I knocked over an entire gallon of blue paint mm. all over the beige wall to wall carpeting. So you made some waves in it like it was the ocean? Well, my first thought was, I'm never going to get that up, so should I just paint the whole carpet in the whole place? But then I was like, I don't think, I don't think the texture of dried paint carpet is going to really be that popular. Mm -hmm. So then, no, I had to go to Sears and I had to re-carpet the whole thing. Oh. But it wasn't that expensive. I was really surprised. I thought it was going to be some horrible, mm -hmm. horrible astronomical thing, and it just a few hundred dollars. Maybe because it wasn't that big a condo. Yeah. Because why? You already had the padding. Because generally it's like, yeah, it's, we'll install it for free, but then it's like the padding ten dollars a yard to. I don't know. I don't remember. <laughs> do padding. That, and... I just remember I was surprised that it wasn't that expensive. Mushrooms, beans, green beans, shredded lettuce and shredded lettuce. We'll tell you that story someday. Shredded cheese and shredded cheese. A mango. That was a wily mango. It was, was it? it was Elusive? Roll, it was trying to roll itself into the basement. Uh, we've got your, at one time frozen, but not now, crinkle cut fries. Mm. So we'll probably just pop those right in the oven mm -hmm. right away. Hamburger buns. Mini sweet peppers. Bananas. Lots of bananas for freezing and banana bread. More bananas. They're looking pretty ripe. These are the ones that could be eaten this very minute or in the next five minutes. <laughs> They're very fresh. But after that, yeah. they have a five minute, mean, five minute shelf life, and then they become freezing bananas. They feel pretty firm. Yeah, I, these they, seem good. That's probably why they threw them away, just the color. But they probably just got new ones in. Somebody ordered too many bananas. They just yeah. got, they just got new ones. I don't even know if anybody does ordering. Like, does anybody really do ordering at Aldi? We've got tilapia. And you know what happened? I don't even know if you know what happened to the other tilapia. For I remember because I wanted to eat it. I know. And I was really looking forward to I it. I know. And your dog. So, oh, did. All right, Dumpstrinas and Frugalistas. I hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you guys are doing well. Thank you for watching. Just as Frugal Daddy and I were walking away, I said to him, did you go buy ice cream sandwiches? because I saw there were ice cream sandwiches in the freezer. And he's like, no, no, that's from the dumpster. Oh my God, that's the best part. So he's just running to get the ice cream sandwiches. Sorry, sorry, don't know what happened there. We got chicken thighs and chicken tenders. I brought them inside to rinse them off and they're gonna go back out on the grill. Yay. And here he is. I forgot the best part. Remember these? I thought you'd actually gone out and, and bought ice cream sandwiches. I know I because really... it looked so good. Yeah. I was thinking. I mean, the box looks perfect. Yeah, someone probably said, oh, oh man, I'm trying to grab the one in the back. Look, it's beautiful. Look, you can even see inside. Are you going to try one? I'd like to. Go ahead. And there's no high fructose corn syrup. It was pretty cold out last night, and you went. Oh, yeah. I pretty went. I was very early. Early in the morning. Early bird gets the it's ice, cream ice cream sandwich worms. Or late at night, early yeah. in the morning. Look at that. Look. This could be our best Ooh. frozen foods grab ever. They look pretty intact. I don't see any like melted goo trying to refreeze in the you, box. You know what really? Neapolitan ice cream sandwiches. Mm. I'm not sure I was aware that these existed. No. It's a great thing if you like Neapolitan ice cream, which in case you don't know is a combo of strawberry, vanilla, and chocolate. Not all like swirled together, but just like in bricks. That looks pretty good. Generally, they might um, yeah. get like a dark freezer burn type thing. That does look pretty good. Mm -hmm. a, little, a little squash, but not, not too much. 
Tastes like it just came out of the freezer. Which it did. Right. <laughs> Tastes like it just came out of the freezer, not having spent several hours in a dumpster before going into the freezer. Look who I... wants some, but she can't have it. No chocolate for dogs or cats. Well, there you have it. We 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 bring we bring dessert. Oh, we bring it all. <laughs> Thank you for watching. We will see you again soon. Take care. Stay diving. I bit off more than I could chew. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs>